it's Emily here at Textile Express and I'm here to talk to you today about our range of outdoor fabrics. So we've had a fairly miserable spring so far, um, but we've actually had a little bit of sunshine today. So I thought now is the right time to show you some of our fab outdoor and waterproof fabrics. So we'll start off with our basic range of plain fabrics. So they come in three different qualities. The heaviest weight being our Tex-X PU coated fabric. So you'll see, as I've got this large piece out here, it's quite a stiff material, um, but it's perfect for outdoor furnitures, particularly um, if you're making covers or perhaps awnings or something where you really need something quite tough. Um, don't be put off by how stiff it appears. It will still go through a standard sewing machine absolutely fine. We would just recommend using a brand new needle when you start to sew. So the Tex XP coated is available just in a range of fairly basic colours. If you're wanting something a bit more multi-purpose um, and also something that's available in a wider range of colours, um, then you'll want to look at our seven ounce PU coated fabric. So straight away, you'll see this is a much lighter weight fabric, but it's actually more waterproof than the Tex X PU coated. So don't let the sort of lighter weight feel put you off and make you think that it's going to be less resistant to the fantastic British weather that we tend to get through the summer. Fingers crossed for some sunshine this year. Um, so seven ounce refers to the weight of it. Um, it's available in a huge range of colours, which I've got some samples of just down here. Um, so you'll see lots and lots of different colours, ranging from bright neon pinks and reds and greens, and then down to some of the more traditional colours like your bottle green to navy blues. Um, the grey is always a really, really popular option. And then also some nice neutrals like the white, the ivory and also the beige. Um, so again, it is perfect for outdoor furniture, outdoor bean bags, um, anything like that really. But it's also soft enough to be used in dressmaking. Um, so if you wanted to make a waterproof jacket um, or also if you needed something to use as a bag lining or to make a waterproof bag, um, we'd recommend the seven ounce because it's much more malleable. Uh, so much better for things like dressmaking, craft projects, where you need a softer cloth. And then finally, in the plains range, um, we have this fire retardant PU coated fabric. So weight wise, it's probably somewhere between the seven ounce and the tex PU coated. It's only available in a couple of basic colors, um, but really good if you're in a commercial setting so sort of like pubs, clubs, hotels, that sort of thing, where you need the cloth to be fire retardant. Um, so we've got you covered on that. So not only do we have a fantastic range of planes, and I must admit the planes are probably more popular than the um, printed ones, but still, some people much prefer the prints. I personally love a print, um, and also it can be really fun I think more and more people are improving that outdoor space and making the most of that outdoor space. And it's becoming like an extra room in your home. So we're seeing more and more outdoor furniture sets with beautiful cushions on them, people using outdoor rugs, all that sort of thing to get a, a, a homely feel, but outside in the garden. Um, so it could be really nice to mix the prints with the planes to get that sort of um, interiors sort of level of design but in your outdoor space. So we'll start off with some stripes. So we did our very own range of stripes. These are called the paint stripe. They are available as a curtain fabric if you're interested in that um, but they're also really popular so we decided to do them as a waterproof fabric in three colorways. So we've only got a little bit of navy left but we've still got plenty of this gorgeous green and also a gray. Um, so it's one of our fabrics, we've designed it in-house, um, it's sort of this rustic stripe um, with sort of rough edges but I think it gives a really nice feel to the cloth um, and it is printed in Spain so it's nice to know that it's European and it's not being produced miles and miles away um, and it's a really good waterproof cloth, um, this same quality is also available in our wash blanket in the grey, which has been the most popular 
colour. Um, so we thought that was a good one to use outdoors as well. But it's a nice soft cloth, um, still really water resistant. You're not going to have any problems if it's left out in the rain. Um, and this, in comparison to the other stripes that I'm about to show you, is a printed stripe. So you'll see the background is just white. Um, in comparison, these brand new stripes for this season, which I would say are an indoor-outdoor crossover. Um, so they're very much suitable for outdoor, they're water resistant, um, but they are soft enough to use indoor as well. If you just want a really good basic stripe, they're still nice and soft, you could still use them for curtains and blinds. Um, so these are our indoor outdoor bold stripe. They're available in three colors. So the classic navy blue, this lovely neutral, and then also the gray color. And they're really wide width, they're 160 centimeters. So as standard, we find most fabrics come in 140, um, actually our plain waterproofs are available in 150 but if you really need something that little bit wider check out these stripes because they're 160 centimeters wide um, they're washable you can cool wash them um, and also they are water repellent as I mentioned before and yeah indoor outdoor crossover um, and suitable for I would say you know lighter wear I don't think there's many outdoor furniture that really needs um, super duper heavy um commercial sort of standard upholstery weight fabrics so really nice classic stripes perfect for the garden and for your outdoor furniture and then the other design that we find that's really popular for outdoor furniture is sort of aztec type designs so i've just pulled out these two qualities to show you um this one first of all it's like a tapestry quality fabric to feel it I don't think you would really know that it was waterproof, which is very clever, um, but it's a gorgeous grey and sort of neutral, natural tone um, diamond. This one is the S213, I think. Yeah, the Valencia diamond. Um, and it's actually a Teflon coated fabric. So it's got really, really high um, sort of water resistance. It's going to be really, really tough, perfect for outdoors. In this similar quality, we also do a chevron design if you're not very keen on the diamonds, but you like the look of the cloth. Um, and obviously if you want to have a feel of the fabric, then we send out free samples of any of our fabrics. So that includes the entire range of waterproof fabrics that I'm showing you today. And then last but not least, um, this comes from one of our French suppliers um, and it's a really lovely Aztec design. We also have this in a teal color and it's called the Aztec Outdoor. This in particular is the mustard and the code is H320 um, and it's 1550 a meter, so a bit of a bargain. In fact, I should have probably run through some of the prices for you, um, but what we'll do is we'll tack those in the co comments at the bottom um, and if you need links, then we'll pop those in there as well so you can view the whole range. Um, so yeah, really lovely soft, um, handle again I think outdoor fabrics are coming on more and more they're feeling less plasticky and more like fabric every season we go through um, and this is a great example of that so it's a really nice weight perfect for outdoor furniture for cushions again it's soft enough that it could be used for bags or also for dressmaking anyway um, that is the full range of outdoor fabrics that I'm going to be showing you today. There are more designs available on the website, so make sure you check that out. And you can always visit us in store as well if you're wanting to have a look and feel of the fabrics and you are local to us. Um, thank you for joining us today. Any questions, pop them in the comments below. And if you've enjoyed this and you'd like to find out more about some of our fabrics or you'd like free tutorials and information on sewing, then make sure you follow and subscribe to our channel. Thank you very much and see you all soon.